What I loved to see during our rehearsal time was the interaction among the delegates, uh, whether that was in our group discussion time, whether that was in the breakout rooms, um, and even when we were, we were playing on the screen. Although I couldn't hear you, I could still see the way that uh, all of you were really trying to play. You were moving your bodies to the, to the emotion of the music. And this was very inspiring. And it's, it's fantastic that even though we were in so many different countries, we could still come together in a very special way to collaborate. My key takeaways from the session was that music is powerful in a sense that it can bring a lot of people together. I found it really amazing how we had people from so many different countries come together and make music and it made me realize once again that music has that ability to connect people and bond people. What I liked the most about the preparation is also related to the virtual element as since the last in-person IASIS in 2019, this was the first collaborative event across schools that we have done for music. And I really enjoyed being able to play and interact with the other students from other schools because it brought back the collaborative element that is so central to any kind of orchestral or chamber music. I really treasured our time together in the January session as we have never actually had the opportunity to gather as a group of six schools in person or virtually. I felt grateful for the opportunity to work with Mr. Mann alongside my peers, and I hope we will be able to see each other again next year as well. The thing I liked most about the preparation was definitely getting to know people from the different schools and practicing together with them. The discussions and activities that I had in the breakout rooms really allowed me to get to know not only the members, but also um, how their schools were like and how the different countries they came from were like, which was really interesting. My overall feelings about Elgar's Nimrod uh, center around how beautiful it is and how it's sort of this rolling, uh, flowing masterpiece that seems to grab me at the core every time and always awaken my emotions. I've always felt such a deep connection to Elgar's music and somehow to the man. Hearing his music feels like going home. It's very comforting, even if like there's discomforting passages there. His music is deeply familiar to my soul in some strange way. I am sure I can't be alone in this. This IASIS is certainly different from previous cultural conventions, and I wish that I could have been with you in person, but it's so inspiring to see the way that uh, all of us have been able to come together with the technology available to us to be able to present music in this way which can actually reach uh, more diverse audiences, uh, it can reach places in the world that do not listen to classical music so much and I encourage all of you in the future to keep pushing the boundaries with technology, finding ways to share your ideas, your loves, your passions with the world.